The business sector has called for a further easing of anti-epidemic measures, but their hopes are slim after the city's leader complained that failure to comply with the remaining restrictions could lead to a rebound in cases, Jen Slow reports. The scrapping of hotel quarantine is seen as a major step for the city to reconnect with the rest of the world. But some consider it's not enough to revitalize the economy. The Hong Kong General Chamber of Commerce welcomed the initiative as it has attracted more business people to visit the city. But the chamber is lukewarm about the three-day medical surveillance, which bars those with an amber coat from premises like restaurants. Chamber Chief Executive George Leung said that could affect attendance for conferences and large-scale events. Many in the business community have instead gone to restriction-free countries such as Singapore, and events have also been relocated. But Leung's hopes for a zero-plus-zero zero arrangement to be implemented soon are slim. The city's leader has complained about cases of non-compliance including the issuance of fake medical certificates and people not observing isolation rules. The success of the zero plus three plan will not be as effective because there may be a rebound of cases simply because of people's not complying with what they are required to do. We have to condemn this non-compliance because it affects every one of us. Lee added that a COVID resurgence will delay a return to full normality. Finance Chief Paul Chen, meanwhile, said COVID has hampered efforts to attract and retain talent, but is confident that the situation will improve as Hong Kong opens up again. Janice Lowe, HKIBC.